<laughs> Hello? Hello? Hello, is anybody there? Yes. Where are you? I'm right here. <laughs> <laughs> so this is a trick about a movie, a book, called Bird Box. If you've seen this movie or read this book, please raise your hand. I have no idea if anybody just did this. So in case you haven't seen it or read it, let me tell you about it. It is called Bird Box and it is about fear. It is about confronting your fear or being so afraid to that we wear blindfolds, metaphorical and physical. My biggest fear is getting a trick wrong here in the Penguin Live studio. That would really suck. So tonight I'm going to give myself three chances to get it right. Using this book, I'm going to have people choose words. If you choose a word, I'd like you to remember it. I'm going to see if I can get it a little bit later on. This is how we choose the word. I will flick down the corner of the book. Whenever you want, please say stop if you are helping. All I'd like you to do is remember the very first word on that page. If you can't see a word on that page because it's a new chapter, tell me to move on and you can have a different page. It's no problem. But please make sure you remember that first word. No others, I'll come back to you soon. For now, if everyone could please put their hands out in front of them like this, because I'm gonna walk over to you with my hands out. I've heard America can be quite litigious and I don't wanna get sued, so. <laughs> Keep those hands out for me. Okay, whose arm is this? Andrew's. Girl. Please say stop. Please remember the first word on the page. Do you have it? Thank you so much. Everyone, please place your arms out again. Who is this? Girl. Please say stop. Do you need glasses, did you say? It's okay, put them on. You got them? Please say stop. Okay, please remember the first word on the page. Do you have it? You've still got your glasses on and you've read it. Good, okay, thank you. Please place your hands out again. Who is this? Boy. Boy. Please say stop. Please remember the word on the page. Do you have it? Great, thank you so much. The three people who are currently thinking of words, could you please stand up for a moment? Okay, I'd like you to join me by staying where you are, but by being blindfolded. The easiest way for you to do that is by closing your eyes. Please close your eyes and just dip your heads and listen very, very carefully. I'm going to say three words. Don't do anything yet. Just listen to whether or not I say your word. The first word I'm going to go for is... Um, Oh, it's a word that we don't really use in the UK. We say it differently. Like, we say mummy, but you say mommy. That's the first one. Mommy. The second word is um, uh, special. I'm not sure. Uh, maybe special. The third word, with. Keep your eyes closed. If I just said your word, please sit down. Did everybody sit down? How many people are still standing? Boy or girl? Girl. Girl. Is it Kelly? Yes. Kelly, I didn't quite get your word, did I? No. Um, please open your eyes, sit down for me. Okay. Um, Kelly, what was your word? Science. Oh, so I thought it was special. It's very similar letter-wise, which means I, um, I messed it up. Oh. The trick went wrong. My biggest fear came true. And yet I look around and I see all of you here inside of this theatre, watching a magic show that you came to and you knew that it was going to be a magic show. That's great, right? <laughs> so if anything, this isn't a nightmare, it's a dream. And in dreams, things always come true. So the word you were looking for was science. So I didn't need to be afraid. All I needed to do was take off my blindfold and... <laughs> science! <laughs> we did it.